Hey, what's up, guys? It's Ernie. We're back with another Roblox group in the store. Today, we're going to be making rebirths in our clicking simulator. So, yeah, let's get into it. So, first, you're going to actually want to, um, in replicate storage, edit a remote event, and call it rebirth. So, I have the scripts already because I don't want, because this would be a very long tutorial. And yeah, by the way, we're making rebirth today. So, in service, script service, add a script. And the link for this will be in the description. Uh, just copy this that I made. Boom. So now this will, so you see the leader stats, it'll just multiply your rebirths times two or times whatever you want. I recommend doing it times two. Then once you rebirth, it gives you plus one rebirth and minus all your clicks. So now in start a GUI, Add a screen GUI, or no, a in, inside of screen GUI, add a frame, and scale this to whoever you want. I'd say about this big. And then add a UI corner, make it round, and I'll s let's say about 20 for roundness. Then you can make this any color you want. I'm just gonna make it this outline color. Copy that and then just paste it here. So now you can add a text label. I'll just make it go like this. I'm gonna make the background transparency to this one text scaled. I'll just make this vertical one. Rebirth like so. Um, actually, no, I'm gonna send this like a 50, maybe 70. Yeah, 70. Duplicate this right down here. This, but don't make the text. Just, make it sca just scale it out. This will say label right here. And name this body. You don't have to name the title or anything. Since, and also inside here, add a text button. Make it. Customize it however you want. I'm just going to add another UI corner and put this into here. And background color, you can make this a red because this is going to be our cancel button if you accidentally open it. Cancel. Click scaled. I duplicate that. And how much is this? 40 away. So 40. And this will say rebirth. And you can name this Rebirth button. And make the text a green, or a background color green. So the script for this will be in the description as well. And just copy it. Also name this close. So now add a local script into here. Paste in the script, all this, and then you can customize this. I'm just gonna make this like a, yeah, let's say a hundred. And we also, finally we have to add a button to actually open the GUI, of course. So we're just gonna make this, or er, roundify is border. make the text button a little smaller this and I'm gonna get this background color put it into the roundify uh, image color and this index to this so I did it to color from here copy that paste that in now in text, we're just gonna make this say text scaled and say rebirth radical one. And then add a local script. Say script dot parent dot mouse click next function. 
script dot parent dot parent dot dot frame dot visible equals false. And actually, I need to check this local script really quick. Yeah, okay, yeah, this is fine. Now just make sure this is visible is off. And now you can go ahead and test it out. And I actually was playing around with this before the video, so I'm just gonna set my rebirth to one. So yeah, rebirth, as you can see. Uh, I accidentally messed up the script. This is true, not false, my bad. Also, sets, run service, script service, and leader sets. I make this a one. So you start off with one, and so we can multiply it. Just wait for that. Now, we have one rebirth. Rebirth, uh, you need 100 clicks to rebirth. You need more clicks, so press cancel. Let me just... Ooh, okay, yeah, this was from the rebirth thing earlier. So you get 100 rebirth. As you can see, we get two. Now, we get, like, twice as much. See, we need 200. Five, so now we got seven for each click. Because I accidentally made it three at the beginning. There we go. So yeah, that'll be it for today's tutorial. I hope you enjoyed. So leave a like and subscribe and comment down what you want next. So yeah, bye.